Hi, everyone. It's Sheila. And oh, my goodness, I'm finally back. I don't even know where to begin. I am. Uh, I've had the most horrible week ever. And at the same time, I, I know I'm very blessed, so I'm not complaining at all. It was just one of those weeks. I on the past weekend, I did a lot of recording. I was so proud of myself because I came in here. I, oh, I cleaned on that Friday night, cleaned my room, my home from top to bottom because I wanted to spend my whole Saturday with you all. And, um, and I did. But you wouldn't know that because my computer died on Saturday night. Um, I was able to download, I think, one of my videos on Saturday and then the rest of them to put gone because I lost my hard drive was bad. And then they discovered that my windows had a lot of errors in it. So they had to go in and uninstall my windows and reinstall. And all of that being said means I lost all my videos. Not very happy about it, but I have no one to blame but myself because I did not, I didn't back anything up. And um, that was my own fault. I should have known better, but I just, uh, I don't know. I have no excuse. I just didn't do it. So I did go out and um, I got my computer all fixed and I am going to be backing up <laughs> all my videos from this point on. Um, so that being said, this should never happen to me again. But unfortunately, I lost a very important video, which would have been played in part with this little haul that I have today. And I had a request to do a hair video and to talk to you all about my hair because I don't know. Um, I'm sure you do know, but um, I have worn, I wore tracks in, in most of my videos. You will see that I had tracks in and I, um, I made the journey or the decision to go natural probably about six or so years ago. I don't know. It's been a long time, maybe even longer than that. But anyway, it was a long time ago. I made the decision to go natural. I could not do the big chop. And um, so I started wearing extensions or tracks and I wore tracks and I wore tracks and I wore tracks. And that was okay because I found that they were so much fun and they were easy and, and I just loved it. And I didn't, I mean, I could look from one way to another. I could have curly hair. I, and I mostly stuck with curly hair, but there were times I did some straight hair um, because I really do like the curly hair, um, which is ironic because when I was younger and I had beautiful long curls, I hated it, but I'd give anything to have those beautiful long curls back. But anyway, long story short, um, over the years, I wore tracks and I never did the big cut. I was able to um, allow my hair to grow to the point where when I got it cut, I was getting it cut at a decent length and um, I had no, you know, I didn't have to have any more relaxer in my hair. So I have been actually totally, totally natural for at least five years. I know. And I love it. I love embracing my natural hair. I have very, very thick hair and um, it requires a lot of love when it's, it's um, in its natural state. Because, of course, from having relaxers in it, I don't have those beautiful, beautiful curls that I used to have. But I do have a decent amount of curls still left in my hair. Just not as pretty as it used to be. But that's okay because I'm working on getting it back. So that being said, I made the decision a few weeks ago or about a month or so ago that I was not going to continue to wear my extensions. That I was going to embrace back into my natural hair. Sometimes maybe with flat iron it and sometimes just doing what you see today. Now, today I am air drying, so um, it is, you know, kind of like in a fro state. And this is how much shrinkage I get from my hair just air drying. It's amazing how much hair can shrink. But I'm okay with that. And um, I hope you're okay with looking at me this way because um, this is really what I look like if I just washed and go. And I do have a few products in my hair, which I will share with you some of the things that I bought in my haul today. And, um, and tell you first impressions basically on them because I this is the second time I've washed my hair since I've had my hair natural. And the first time I just kind of blew it out straight. And um, when I did that, I used this Twisted Sista straightening um, blow dry cream, which I absolutely thought was very good. Um, I got this at Target. No, I'm sorry. No, I got this at Walgreens and I think it was like $5.29. And um, 
pretty good stuff. I have no complaints about this. It helped my hair straight. It helped, you know, it helped it to stay straight or get straight, I guess is a better way to explain it. So I truly, truly enjoy that product. So, but this week I decided to wash my hair and um, I was going to actually do twisties and then do my twist outs. And I did try to do it last night. I did a horrible job. I don't think I did it. I was trying to watch a YouTube video and watch a girl do it and do it mine at the same time. And I goofed and it didn't come out very good. So I had to co-wash my hair this morning very quickly. And um, when I co-wash my hair, I threw in my hair this item and this item. And both of these items are by As I Am, which this one is a twist defining cream. And that's what this one looks like. And um, inside, this looks kind of like a pudding. It's like a pudding texture. This stuff smells awesome. It, it just smells so good. But this was very expensive. I got this at Sally's and I paid, I ended up paying $18.99 when it was all said and done. But the price is $21.99. If you have a Sally's card, it's $19.99. But until the end of the month, they do have this at a dollar off. So if you're either military, you can get the card. Or if you are, um, a, um, if you have your license and you can get the card. So, I mean, it's kind of worth it having it. Um, I've had my card for years and I got my card from being military. So I've had my card for years. And so it does help to save a few dollars off. But I do really like this. I have it in my hair right now. And it honestly, I have to say it has made my hair much more manageable because I have a strange texture of hair. My hair is super, super curly. I don't know if you can see some of the pieces, like some of the curls, like see how this little piece, where is that? Right here. See how that looks? Well, I have pieces of my hair. This is what my hair looked like when I was a child growing up. Almost completely straight with curls, didn't look, didn't have much of a kinky texture. And then I started, you know, doing the whole, I'm gonna, I'm grown and I'm gonna put a relaxer in my hair and my hair just went haywires. So some of my hair came back in its natural pattern and some of it came back a little bit more coarse. So I have this wild thing going in my head. Like it's crazy. So it's really hard for me to figure out what products to use in my hair. So I am very impressed with this. Very impressed. Now this is a, um, like I said, it's a twist defining cream. So this is for, you know, doing twist outs and things like that. And what I did today is when I co-wash my hair, and I don't, I didn't bring that in here, but the, I have the same product in the co-wash treatment. And that was like $8.99 with a dollar off. So that made it $7.99, I believe, at Sally's. But I co-washed my hair with that. And then I put some of this in there. And well, no, I put the leave-in conditioner first, which is what the other item is. And this is also by As I Am. And this is a leave-in conditioner. I got this at Sally's too. And I think this was like $8.99 with a dollar off coupon. But I put the leave-in conditioner in my hair while my hair was wet. And then I used the twist defining cream along with this eco styler. And this is um, a maximum hold gel. And this has the, Arag um, the Arag Aragon, Argon oil in it as well. So I bought this big thing at Sally's and it was like $5.49. So my husband can definitely share using this with me. Um, this my husband has naturally curly hair as well so this is a product that i heard about i stopped the lady in the mall the other day and she was so sweet and kind to share with me because her hair looked beautiful and she shared with me what she used in her hair now she said the only thing she uses in her hair is a stay in a leave-in conditioner and this but i know that my hair and i wasn't sure what her texture of her hair was actually so I, like i said i know i got some parts in there that's kind of coarse and kinky looking and so i was thinking I want extra protection. So I set out to find something like this. Paid a little bit more for this than what I really wanted to, but I am impressed with it so far. I like that my hair feels soft and not hard, yet I have some defineness to my curls. So I combined both of these together and um, I just set my hair air, air dry today. So those were my products from, oh wait, one more item I got from Sally's and this is an Afro stretch curl cream and it says for kinky corly and um, that this had like several steps like there was one if you had a one if you had one type of hair a two if you had another type three if you had one type and four if you had another type well I felt four was best for me the kinky corly hair because 
I got good stuff and I got kinky stuff. My kinky stuff is like right in here in this part right back here. So I wanted to try this. I found this actually before I found the As I Am product. And um, so I wanted to give it a try. And what intrigued me the most on this is it says it defines natural curl pattern, moisturizes and revives shine. But this is the killer here. Helps eliminate shrinkage. That is what caught my eye. So when I read that, I thought, Ugh, I really need this. And I didn't put this on today, um, but I am going to try this. I really, I'm, I want to see if that works because I have a lot of, a lot of shrinkage. Like my hair is almost, it's like right here if I have it pressed out. And if not, this is where it's at. So as you can tell, I have a lot of shrinkage. So I'm curious to see if this will actually, let's see, I don't know. There we go. Hopefully this will actually work and um, aid in, you know, making my hair stay a little bit stretched out. So we shall see. And this is just a white product. It doesn't really even have a smell. And I mean, it's a light smell, but it doesn't, it's almost not a smell that I can even explain. So can't really say too much about the smell. Hope that in my hair. But um, that is everything that I got at Sally's. Now, um, of course, the As I Am products does have shampoos, but they're like $8.99. And even with the dollar off coupon, you know, I was just like, you know what? That's enough money right there. So I didn't want to spend any more money. So I, I had seen on a young lady mentioned this on YouTube that had beautiful curly hair. And um, when she mentioned it, I thought, you know what? I think I'm going to give this a try. It sounds like it may be something that will work for me. And um, when I realized that it was it was made with coconut extract, I really got excited. So that being said, I ended up with the Herbal Essence Hello Hydration because as we all know, the key to wearing your hair naturally is to make sure that it stays hydrated. So I got the Hello Hydration Herbal Essence. I got the shampoo and the conditioner and I got the big bottles. Um, they were like $4.99 a piece. So for like $10, which is like the price I would have paid for the shampoo and just the, and the As I Am product. So I did wash my hair with this last night and I conditioned it and I feel that my hair got clean. It felt good. It felt soft. So I don't, I don't see that this is going to be a problem using this. And then this is something that, like I said, my husband has naturally curly hair as well. So this is a product that I can place in the shower and I don't mind him using because he's not as careful with things as I am. He when he set them up on the shelf in the shower and then let water get all inside of it because he didn't close it up. And if I spend like, you know, $10 on a product, I don't want him to do that. Ah! <laughs> oh, my goodness. Sorry, everyone. But um, I wouldn't want him to like waste a product like that because these are kind of small, you know, and that's the same size the shampoo would have been. So anyway, that being said, um, I really, really do like that product. Now, the last product that I want to show. Yeah, the last product that I want to show you is been actually the most used product since I purchased it. I bought it last week. So excited about it. And that was my coconut oil. Now, I think I may have showed this in my haul video. I don't know. I can't remember if, my haul, if I lost my haul video or not. If I actually, you know what? I think I didn't get it downloaded. So no, you didn't see it. But I picked up the coconut oil per extra virgin um, extract or not extract. I'm sorry. The pure virgin oil coconut oil and that's what it looks like and i don't want to open this because honestly my room is a little bit warm i probably should have the ac on it seems like it's kind of watery in there so um i don't want to open it up because the coconut oil as you all know when it gets warm or if it touches your body heat it will become liquefied and um i have used this coconut oil on my entire body my feet my hands my legs my arm and my entire body my hair, especially, I have embraced it in my hair. Like every night, I run it through my hair. After I wash my face, I use it on my face to um, to make sure that my my skin is is getting some, you know, getting some oilness to it. And um, excuse me, I actually love it. Just think it's the greatest thing in the world. Like I just think it's awesome. And um, my hands are very dry by nature, and I have noticed a big difference in using it on my hands. They don't feel nearly as hard as they used to. So I'm real excited about that. But yeah, so um, yeah, that has been my haul 
and uh, kind of like a combination of my haul and me talking about my hair as well. So this is the best thing I can give to the lady who wanted me to do um, a hair video because unfortunately I don't have that video to show you with my uh, tracks in. But uh, yeah, this is me and my natural hair. And if you have any questions about it, feel free to ask. Um, I kind of think I covered a lot today. So if you have any questions about any of the products, if you want me to come back and talk about them, if I use them a little bit more, feel free. I will be more than happy to share with you all. Right now, I think um, the As I Am products are extremely good, um, a little bit pricey, but if it's an item that works and does your hair good, of course, it's worth the money. Of course, we all have different textures of hair, even though we may be in natural states, we all have different type of hair. And so our hair needs will be different. So what may work for me may not work for you. And we all know that. So or what works for you may not work for me. So bear that in mind if you try any of these products. But I am highly impressed with the items that I do have. And I think I'm going to enjoy my journey of, um, you know, embracing wearing my own natural hair instead of having extension or tracks in my head. So I want to say to you all, thanks so much for sharing this a little few minutes with me today. Have a wonderful evening. God bless. Bye-bye.